kill him. Don't die. Don't be enough to die. Time to get out of here. And is it just me or did I hear stuff get broken? I can swear I heard that. Cast, heal. Do you have heal? Please tell me you have heal. No, of course you don't have heal. That might explain why some of my crap was broken, because it sounded like some of my armor got sundered there. I mean, you heard it too, didn't you? It sounded like a cracking noise. It may have just been their sound effects whenever they hit some. They do break gear. And she can't fix whenever she's unconscious. Well, we'll just fix that with a little bit of resting. What? Where? Invisible dragonfly! Run! Oh, sweet Jeebus. I'm gonna get killed by the weakest thing ever. I can't even see it and it's gonna kill me. Yes. Keep hitting for Go after Forad and nobody else. No! This is not good. This is not good. Quick. I, I know I can't switch between characters in combat. Just drink. It's not my thing. Don't drink the wand. Oh, sweet Jeebus. I'm gonna die here just because I... Just be... Well, use him then. I'm going. I know I can't switch characters between combat. Thank you for reminding me that game. I should be able to see my monster. That's. Help. And for Adari kills the thing. Oh my gosh. It, uh, okay, that right there is enough to. I mean, that freaked me out when I could see the dragonfly. It, it was an invisible monster, you know what I mean? <sighs> Madness. Madness. Alright, I'm going back to the city, and I'm going to rest up there, because if we get even a dragon firefly anymore, we're toast. We're just dead and simple, so. All right, time to get out of here. Well, not out of here, but out of dodge is what I meant to say. It's enough to make anyone nervous. Anyone. Now, if I recall correctly, yes, tavern right here. Sleep. Come in! Come in! Sleep. Sleep. Ah, <laughs> I'm like narrowly cheating death. Hi, sorry to bother you. Bye. All right, let's head back out to the Duke's Keep. I'm sure we only have one more guard to kill, and we'll be done with it. Well, as soon as we fix our boots, that is. It's repaired. There you go. Put those booties back on. I don't know what else we've got broken, but whatever for right now. For right now, it's just whatever. Normally, I would just go out and I'd just be like, oh, hey, we'll just go to the expert trainer who I believe is in town? Question mark? I'm not sure. But if I recall correctly, there was a bunch of trainers out by the magic shops, and hopefully that's indicative of somebody being able to teach expert training in Or to give expert training in element. If that's the case, we're good, we're set, and we'll be able to go to the arena every day. Because we have appeared and set up a teleportation or a teleportation stone called 
Town Portal Altar, we've set one of those up out by here, the Cold's Place. So, in theory, we should be able to get arena fights every day, and that'll give us a much needed gold and XP boost. See, that's the reason why I like this game. That's the reason why I like this game, but it's like one of the few reasons why I like this game is because the arena fights are daily. That's the reason why I like Might and Magic 3 was you could go to the arena whenever you wanted. Might and Magic 4 and 5 for that matter. 6 to 8. What were you guys thinking? But the reason why I didn't like 3 to, or 3 to 5 for its arena fights was because there was no gold to be had, you know? Come on, give me some gold. Not the fun of any game is getting a huge pile of hoarded wealth, you know. Something to rival even almighty Bahamut himself. And so you know, I'm not talking about the Final Fantasy version, I'm talking about the D&D &D version. And again, broken gear. You die now. Haha, <laughs> give me that sweet, sweet scent of life. Er, I don't know where I'm going with that. I don't know. Like I just said, I'm not used to talking for this long. I just haven't done it in a while. I have a heart, viewers. And I'm going to want to throw a few more heals around, just in case there's a trick up, uh, up the Duke's sleeve. Now, what have we learned about approaching somebody who might potentially use traps to their advantage? Never stand on the red carpet. I don't know if it's true or not, but whatever. We've been sent by Mark Kelly Great. He wants you to leave. Well, there's always a sword. Who use force against me? Yes. Then leave. 